The North Las Vegas Fire Chief says this fire could have been so much worse. A grandmother got two of her grandchildren out of the fire, but a third, a five-year-old, didn't make it out right away. And today, firefighters and the family met to talk about what happened. A five-year-old Malia means the world to her sister, Carlicia. We might fight and stuff, but I still love her today. She is the best sister I've ever had. The two girls and their young brother were all in the condo when flames broke out. And that's when my grandma started hearing popping noise, and she thought about us as she ran up the stairs and saw flames coming out the laundry room. The eight-year-old couldn't see, and her grandmother, Lynn Armstrong, guided them out by telling the kids to follow her voice. They all got out, but little Malia was still inside. These gentlemen were able to get inside with, with little to no visibility and find Malia and get her and bring her to safety. She was removed from the ventilator and is talking and is doing quite well on her road to recovery. Our firefighters did an amazing job that day to save the life of uh, this little girl, Malia. Um, I'm really proud of, of these gentlemen and the hard work that they, they did. And this is where the training that we do as a department and, and as, a, uh, as an organization pays off. Honestly, I'm so thankful that they got her out of there because if it wasn't for them, she would have never survived if she stayed in there longer because all of that smoke and she could still smell it and stuff and it was coming towards her. Just want to thank you guys for saving her. It's glad to be here. We're going to have a lot of fun once she gets out the house. Yes, you will. A great save. And Las Vegas Fire and Rescue also helped, as did some neighbors. Now, we don't know if the home had smoke detectors, but the North Las Vegas chief says they can mean the difference of living or dying in a house fire. He urges everyone to have one and make sure they are working. Live at the Update Desk, Joe Hill, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.